someone's having fantasies about you. The Emperor and Page of Cups. This could be a masculine energy having fantasies about you. This person could want to um, show you some kind of affection or kiss you or something like that. The devil. Eight of Pentacles reversed. Ten of Swords reversed. Three Cups. Okay. Some devil energy is trying to make sure this person doesn't fantasize about you, doesn't focus on you, but this person still is fantasizing about you. They could want to um, make the fantasies or dreams a reality, so to speak. That's what I feel like they're going to do with the Three of Cups. They want to connect or hang out spend quality time with you. This person is learning their lessons with something with some devil energy. The world. Some cycles about to start. This person is completing a tough karmic cycle. They're in this energy where they feel like they don't have to fantasize about you no more. They can act on their desires or whatever this is with this page of cups. They can have this love with you. They can express their feelings with you. They're in this dreamer type of energy. They could be imagining like you're in bed with them, laying next to them or holding them. I'm seeing something like someone's having a hard time sleeping because they miss you. This is an emperor having fantasies. Eight of Wands reversed. This is not just like infatuation fantasies though. I feel like this person is like legitimately has strong emotions and feelings for you. They may want to message you or you guys are going to get a message possibly. You guys could be getting a good morning message or a good morning text to Eight of Laundry first. This person has been holding off on taking action with regards to their dreams or fantasies regards to you. This person could be waiting for something. The lovers reversed. Yeah, you guys could be in separation or something like this because of some devil energy or there's a detachment, sphere of commitment, some karmics. Someone's trying to keep you guys not thinking about each other. Seven of Wands, Hermit. Yeah, they're trying to keep y'all blocked off from each other, possibly lonely or isolated. But you guys are conscious of this. They want you guys to be alone. I just heard something like they want to take you out and show you a good time. This person may want to take you out and do something. King of Swords. This person wants to be honest with you. They want to talk to you. They want to tell you the truth. They want to be reliable. 
they're getting some kind of mental clarity or they in their recent past have gotten some kind of mental clarity having fantasies about them this person feels like they love you so much like that's what they fantasize about like they love you so much they want to spend the rest of their life with you the lord so this is like the lord <clears throat> this is like divine masculine energy cheerfulness See, they may want to take you out to eat. You see that, um, or do a restaurant or something like that. They want to be in the three cups hanging out. You guys are going to be going on a date or something. Journey. Yeah, they may pick you up or. They could be at work having fantasies and waiting to take action on their fantasies once they get home. Love language, quality time. Yeah, see, they want to spend quality time. That could be their love language or yours or both. I see a man here touching a woman's arm and stuff. They're looking each other directly into the eyes. They want something intimate with you. They want it. They want intimate quality time with you. They're tired of just fantasizing about it. Tease. <laughs> this person like they give you feeling teased or something. The energy is fun and lighthearted. But uncertain. Maybe they're uncertain. Maybe you've been teasing them or what? Something with some tease energy. Maybe you're sending them pictures or something. Life partner forgiveness. Your romance is stable and ready to go the distance. I see a man kissing a woman on the cheek. Allow healing waters to wash away the pain of the past. So this is your life partner or going to be. They're going to be honest with you, talk to you and ask for forgiveness or make amends with you. They're going to they're going to tell you the truth regards to something. So they're thinking about dates and stuff, dates, dates, nights, maybe once they get off work or you guys um, get off work. Some Lord, possibly an emperor or a masculine energy having fantasies. This could be both of you guys having fantasies too. Mars in Capricorn authority. This person could be a leader, uh, a boss, something with leadership, or someone that has a lot of responsibilities, a manager. Riches, Saturn in Capricorn. This person could be wealthy, stable, or they're working towards that. There's about to be massive changes. Mercury in Gemini. Excitement. Yeah, they're excited. They're excited to... Um, go on a date or something. Okay, having fantasies about them, lore, cheerfulness, 
journey. Compromise, mutual understanding, flexibility, give and take brings rewards. Okay, yeah, there's a highway here. So you guys may go on the highway um, as you guys go somewhere. This could be at nighttime. It's like a highway at nighttime. Uh, yeah, you're going to have to go on the highway or something to get to where y'all are going. You guys, Some of you guys could be going to a stadium or something and... Um, going to see a game or something. Mutual understanding. Yeah, most of you guys, it's mutual. You guys are both fantasizing. Mystery. Intrigue, suspense, entering unknown territory. Yeah, y'all are both secretly fantasizing about each other. Regrets, life regrets. Start making empowered choices. Someone's in regret. They could be in regret about the way you guys left things. Spirit says they're going to surprise you with something special. These cards are just slipping out of my hands. I get a proper shuffle. I need to get this um, this little lack stuff on my hands to sort quick the moistener. Yeah, I had to moisten up my hands because <laughs> these are slipping. Okay. Yes. Luck is on your side. When this person asks you on a date, you're probably going to say yes. Look, date night. <laughs> Get ready to be wined and dined. I'm telling you. Yes. Cards are slipping. Some of you guys, this could be something about some neighbors. Something about something with school or work is here. School or work. This could be something like a picnic too. Okay, let's get one of these cards and then I'm going to close this out. Something about some date night. They've been having fantasies. I like you. Someone likes you. Romance is blooming. Fun. Flirting. Want to date. You guys could be in separation. Missing you. Thinking about you. Yearning. Unsure of future. See, that's what I'm saying. They're tired of just missing you. They could be looking at your photos. Looking at your photos. Missing you. Nostalgia. Wanting to make new memories. 